Hi boys and girls. When we return to school on Wednesday, we will be starting a new unit, which means we won't be spending much time on insects anymore. My hope is that you know that insects have three body parts, head, thorax, and abdomen. They have six legs and two antennae. Insects also have a skeleton on the outside, a thick armor coating. That is their exoskeleton. We learned that um, earlier in the year that butterflies start as an egg, go to a caterpillar that eats and eats and eats until it turns into a chrysalis and a butterfly emerges. Over the last week, we learned that not all insects go through that process, that metamorphosis, which tadpoles and caterpillars do. Some insects start as an egg, hatch as a nymph, which is a smaller version of an adult, and then they shed their exoskeleton in a process called molting. They molt, meaning they shed their exoskeleton and they come out bigger with a new exoskeleton and then they'll molt again as they grow and they keep molting until they are an adult. Um, I gave you a butterfly journal, or I'm sorry, a backyard bug's journal cover and hopefully you've been keeping track of what insects you've seen and you have a page where you can record it. Now, I know that it is not a requirement, meaning I'm not making you do it, but I do hope that you will add some pages into your journal and continue to investigate different insects that you find in your yard. Your yard is a habitat or home for many different insects and other creatures. So I hope you'll um, spend a little time investigating and observing and seeing what you can learn about these insects. Have a great day.